Be wise and have peace in your country, part one of three, on Between Master and Disciples, given in English on September 20, 2021. Hello, Master. Hi. How have you been doing? Uh, okay, okay. Not bad. How are you guys? Oh, we're very well, Master. We're, yeah, we're you like well. the food still? Oh, yes. Even it, though it's not your taste, maybe? Oh, no, it's it's quite pleasant. We yeah, make different dishes. They try their best, I guess, huh? Yes, they do, Master. Uh, and if you don't like it one day, why don't you just roll up your sleeves and cook something, huh? Uh, yes, that's, that's true. That's true. Cook yourself well, huh? Uh, yes. <laughs> don't let them cook you well. Yes. <laughs> Uh, did you have cakes and uh, uh, grapefruits for Moon Festival that I told them to send you? Oh, uh, we did, Master. Uh, very enjoyable. A lot? Uh, yes, quite a bit. Quite yeah, a bit. yeah. I told them to give a lot, a lot, so you can have the whole month, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> not Moon not moon Festival, but Month Festival. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Master. We yeah. really appreciate it. Yeah, and the work okay? Everything okay? Uh, everything is fine, Master. Yeah, I appreciate you guys for late night, early morning, and... And sometimes I'm in between. <laughs> I appreciate it when you guys wake up uh, after midnight or two, three, four o'clock in the morning without complaining. Or at least I don't hear the complaint. <laughs> <laughs> well, master is working harder than us, so. <laughs> ah, never mind. It's, I deserve it. <laughs> Whatever that's measured to me, I deserve it because I don't have to do it. I chose it myself. Okay, so I can't complain. You guys can complain, but inside. Don't let me hear it. <laughs> 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 Nobody likes to hear complaints. Yeah? No, no, yeah, not yeah. Nice. That's why I don't complain a lot, <laughs> even though I could. As you say, I work the hardest. Yeah, never mind. Never mind. What else to do? People suffer more than us. That's true. Even if we work all day or night, we still are better off than many people. Yes, very much so, Master. Very much so. A lot of people are refugees in war-torn countries. Hunger and now the pandemic even makes more people hungry. Yes. Because they cannot uh, do the work as much as they did before. And then because they cannot uh, harvest very well like before because they don't have enough working staff and many staff are sick and all that. So even supermarkets, they have to close or restaurants have to close because they don't have enough staff. Yes. Either That's staff nice. get sick and die or they are not allowed to go out or they are afraid to go out. Yes, and there is fear. Just, yeah, that's fear. terrible, terrible, terrible. What a terrible world that we have nowadays. And the climate change doesn't help. So many places are drought, chronic drought or chronic floods. And oh my God, I saw that on TV. And it's not much I can say anymore, except feeling so sorrowful. And the angels and the heaven try to comfort me, but it doesn't help me. It doesn't help me to forget all that. Yes, Master. Uh, anyway, uh, it's Moon Festival, and I wish all of you in house, our house, and everyone in the world, whoever can hear me, a very good Moon Festival and a more hopeful future. Oh, thank you very much, Master. And we wish you the same. We wish you a wonderful and beautiful Moon Festival, Master. Yeah, I try to. I try to. <laughs> I try to think that it's Moon Festival, but I don't even know what day it is, and I don't even know if it's the Moon Festival already or not. I'm just reminded by your TV <laughs> <laughs> that they are putting up some program or something and make me check, you know, to celebrate Moon Festival. And then I remember, oh, the Moon Festival. So I uh, ordered to the kitchen and the supplier to bring you some good stuff, you know, like moon cakes. Yes. Chocolate and uh, grapefruit. Grapefruit, yeah? yes. But I think where you live, they have only green ones. But it's still good, right? Sweet, it, right? It, I've not tried, but everyone tells me it's very sweet. Okay, okay. Try it. It's good for you. There's a lot for everybody. 
I ordered at least 12 for each of you. And yes, thank many, you, Master. Yeah, thank many you. cakes and all that. So if you don't have enough, order more, okay? Okay. <laughs> because this season, we have a lot of grapefruit, and it's very, very good for you. Some other years, I ate some. They are always sweet. Uh, yeah, they never disappoint me. Uh, but I haven't eaten yet this year. Oh, yeah, I did eat some time before when they gave. Not these days. No, not these days. Just some other days. Yeah, a long time ago. Okay, I can always have it. Don't worry. Okay, that's good to know. Is there something? Oh, yes, Master, we have some questions. Uh, if we could ask you, if you have time. Sure, sure, sure. sure. It's 2 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> supposed to be sleeping, but I still have a lot of work. Yes. So it doesn't matter if a little bit more. <laughs> it won't kill me. I hope. Women in Afghanistan will be allowed to study in female-only classrooms, and the subjects they take will also be reviewed. We will be able to study that we have a new regulations for the change of the Pantuna. We will be able to look at روی بتیم برای معاصلین که دوباره برای درس بیان پیدات هایشون گفتن رئیس پنزه که صنف های دخترها رو جدا میکنیم با بچه ها و همچنان تایم های درسشون شاید تغییر کنه Master, the Taliban now say that Afghan women can continue their studies in universities but they need to wear a black hijab which would cover them fully except the face They also need to be in separate rooms from the males uh, Master, what do you think about that? Except the face, yeah? Except the face. Oh, that's already an improvement. Yeah, before they have to cover everything in a burger, you know? Yes, everything. Now they accept the face. Are you sure? Yeah? Hijab is uh, accept the face, right? A hijab, accept the face, fully. Yeah, okay, fully from head to toe, but accept the face. Oh, that's already something. At least you can see the sun. <laughs> At least the sun can kiss your face to comfort you, okay? And yes. give you some nice color, vitamin D. Good for people, men and women alike. Uh, yeah, what do I think? I think it's a good improvement already, and uh, people should uh, be happy for any improvement, any progress. The country has just been in turmoil, you know, recently, so whatever improvement, they should welcome it. I know the women love to be beautiful and all that. I do, I do, yes. But nowadays, I'm in retreat, I couldn't care less much. Of course, that's good. But if I'm not with you guys or on camera and all that, I couldn't care less what it is. Oh, when I, I go out alone, you know, without any disciples, uh, I mean, when I live alone without having to do anything with the, the, the work, the mission, then I don't wear any makeup. I don't wear anything uh, luxury. All the things I wear is just because of work, you know, like fashion. Yes. I design them, so I wear them. <laughs> <laughs> like uh, advertisement, yeah? Yes, okay. Master. Otherwise, nowadays, I think the most important thing is you should focus on more than just the looks. Mm. Yes, Master. Are you a woman or something? Why are you so concerned? Oh, well, um, you know, Afghanistan is a very hot country and wearing hijab may be uncomfortable for some women. Yeah, uh, yeah, okay. But better than burger, no? Already? Ah, uh, yes. Burgers cover everything except some net in front of your eyes and you could not even see around. That's true, Master. It's difficult and you fall down sometimes, yeah? Uh, or somebody might attack you and you don't even know yet. You see what I'm saying? Behind you, or, uh, when he comes near you, you don't even see. Yes, so this is an improvement already. Uh, of course, it's not completely to the liking of a woman or many other countries where the dress code is more relaxed and easy, yes? Right, but I'm master. we have to look on the positive side, you know, like, it is good for now because the important thing is to be wise, yeah? And to have peace in the country. So if you just accept it, that will calm down everything now, at least, okay? Uh -huh. more, more for the woman and be more peaceful for them, yeah? Right, mm. right, Master. Yes, because if you show show your beauty, it could be also a risk, especially now, okay? 
when all over it says that um, fighters go out door to door and kidnap girls and force women, you know, raping and all that. So is it better you cover yourself? Yes, I've seen stories about that. It's wise, yeah, to cover more yourself. And also, if you want education, you don't want anything else. If you want to go to school or outside, you want education, safety and peace. So it's good you just go along with it for now. Maybe in the future things will change and you will have more freedom. But right now it's good like that. Yeah? It's right, very Master. good already. Uh, and then if you're separate from the men, it's also good. So both can be more concentrated on education. Yes. Instead of uh, looking left and right and front and back just for something else. Right. It also saves money. Save time for close searching and avoid competitive feelings of the outer look, envies or inferior or superior feelings between the have and the have not. Think positively and concentrate on more important things instead. Yes. I think it's not too bad like that. It's not the worst thing that happened. You know, at least You can go to college, university, or oh, that's a good thing already. Yes. And that's the best thing for you if that's what you want. Yes. Then you can help yourself for a nice future and a good future and uh, for, for the country. You know, contribute to your country and your family. Yes, education is very valuable. Yeah, education is important. More than looks, at least just for now, okay? For peace sake. Yes, Master. I heard some idiom somewhere that uh, if you are on the pirate's boat and you just stay there, don't jump in the sea. <laughs> <laughs> don't jump into the sea because you can't escape either. Yeah? All right. Yeah, you might even lose your life. So whatever situation, if it doesn't endanger your life, then I think we should just accept it. It's good that you ask all these questions. I think it's good that the men ask because it shows that everybody cares. Not not just women who care about themselves. Yes, we, good. we do. Okay. We do, definitely. Uh, you happy with my answer? Uh, yes, Master. Anything else? Yes. Um, some women don't like the new dress code, and right now we see in the news that Afghan women around the world are protesting against the Taliban new hijab mandate by posting photos of themselves wearing colorful traditional dresses on social media. Mm. Does Master have any comment on that? It's also good like that. Why not? They are free to express <laughs> their opinions, yeah? Yes. And besides, uh, the tradition of clothes are very beautiful. Also very dignified. Yes, very much so. Uh, it covers also a, a lot of the body, yeah? Very much so. Yeah, yeah. It's also very, very, uh, very nice clothes. I saw it. I saw it myself. It's very colorful, very beautiful. It shows their... Uh, national mentality, you know? Yes. Like they love beauty, they love brightness, yeah, they love colorful things that make life more bearable. Mm? Yes, very elegant. Elegant, oh, that's good as well. It's just that situation is different. So we just, uh, the uh, Afghan women outside, they can wear what they want. Mm? Right. And that's... the people inside the Afghan country, they should just uh, go with the flow. I think just for peace sake and safety's sake, yeah? Right, Master. More safety, more safety for them. It's, it's good like that also, yes. Uh, I'm answering you, but I just hope they hear me. At least maybe their soul can hear me. And they can, you know, think about it. And just accept it for now, with their own peace and safety, okay? Right. I pray that they have peace and safety for the whole country, men and women alike and the Taliban also, that they have peace with each other, that they have time to think more about enlightenment, more about the Prophet's teaching, peace be upon him, more about Allah, yes? Yes, Master. More about peace within their own country, with each other, and within the international community. Yes, Master. We wish them the very best. Yes. Yes.